Voila. So much for me changing my fucking encoder settings, they're still just as shit. Good evening, how are you? How was your weekend? Students. Yeah, we'll see how this encoder settings work. I might have to change them again. And just shave. Hey, shave! I don't like it. Yeah, aren't you sexy bald Scottish bastard? Oh my god! Ethan, how's it going buddy? Samurai, how are ya? We have improved lightage! <laughs> it actually took me ages to get it to fucking work. I should have, uh, when I first set it up, I, uh, I'm eating m and 
Um, that your thing you like? It is. Yes. It's this bad boy here. Uh, not too hot, mate. Think I've got COVID again. And it's your birthday tomorrow. Ooh, that sucks. Happy birthday for tomorrow, sir. Hopefully you're feeling a bit better by then. If not, um, sucks to be you. Uh, you just have to celebrate your birthday another day, mate. But happy birthday when it comes, sir. Yeah, fuck, I, I was ill for my birthday as well. If it's any consolation, was I ill? Yes, I was. I caught COVID. Yeah, I had COVID on my birthday. So I know exactly how you feel, mate. Fucking shite. Never want it again. The worst bit about it was the fucking nobody would say it's a taste or smell. So we'll see. So yes, so I couldn't figure this lights out earlier on. They were too slow, weren't reacting quite as quickly. Um, but it's because I was running it through the Govi Cloud thing. There's two different connections you can use. The Govi Cloud, which allows you through an API connection. Is it an API? API? Yeah. Or you can run it through a LAN connection, which seems to have worked. It's all right. Already celebrated on Saturday, went to Middlesbrough away, then had a party after. Nice. Did they win? <laughs> That kind of came out of nowhere, that music, didn't it? I need to turn that down a bit. I need to get like an automatic slider so that when I stop talking, not stop talking, when I change scenes, it's so low as it down. It's all right having the audio duck in it, kind of ducks in and out, which is good. Because when I talk, it goes quiet. When I stop, it goes up. Got battered 4-0, 140 miles away from home, but all 2,700 of us were dancing the whole 90 minutes. <laughs> Just the fucking stadium. <laughs> Bouncing up and down. So yes, these lights are now linked into the channel points. So if anyone wants to go daft and probably try and kill me, fire on. I'll put a video in the Discord now. <laughs> nice one. I'll get a look at that in a bit, dude. <laughs> oh, fucker. <laughs> you bastard. <laughs> Oh, they're gonna fucking... <laughs> hit the party one, hit the party one. I tried it earlier on, but it was daylight and it didn't, uh, it didn't quite, it, it wasn't, yeah, I don't think it full effect kicks in until it's dark. <laughs> so it's fucking, it's, uh, yeah. And believe it or not, this is like, this is them only on, like, that one's only on 10%. Oh dear. Does that sound slower? <laughs> Fucking hell, can you develop epilepsy? Or is it something you're born with? They're all kind of falling over, they're all a wee bit drunk. Yeah, so it's also set up to the flash. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my eyes. Oh, yes, it works. Can you link it to your music? Uh, this can. Yes, I can. Well, uh, it's got... Um, I'll show you quickly. Mm. Um, you can... Uh, you, I don't know how well you're going to see this. But you get the little app. You're not going to see that, are you? Oh, tilt it sideways. Oh, fucking hell is that? Anyway, there's a little app. You can fucking do it and stuff like that. And you can get it so that it changes to the music and stuff. Um, I'll see if it'll work now. I mean, that's me talking. So whenever it's obviously I talk, it goes up and down. Blah, 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 blah. You can change sensitivity and you can knock sensitivity right down. So it's... <laughs> or you can have it quite sensitive. But you can also have the... Um, either link through your phone... Or it links through your, um, there's like the little power pack thing that's, that's where the sensor comes from. Night. Night. Um, so yeah. <laughs> so the second, Ethan, I'm going to just reset this to, <clears throat> oh, has that gone back to default? It has. Bunk monkeys. Do you want your spacker? Okay. Fuck off, I my blood hole. Oh, kinky. Right, let's see if that, uh, bad ball. There we go. 
don't know why it didn't work. It's probably because I was fucking about with it in the app even. But yeah, you can do lots of things. It's got like a little thing that's uh, each, uh, it's got segments in it, so they're all addressable, if that makes sense. Um, it's nonsense. I've lost the app. I keep losing it. Okay, night. But anyway, you can, you're not going to see it. You see the snake at the bottom. You can all do that color, different colors and stuff. Yeah, it's got like, um, Bear. there's like scenes and stuff in it. Oh, God. Do you want them locks in here? Uh, yes, please. It has got scenes and stuff. Um, you can sort of change things. So it's got like things like this. Um, don't know how well that'll work. Okay, I'll come across. That's Meteor. Uh, this is Fire. That's fucking bright. Uh, rainbow! We can't really see that because it's too bright. Uh. Uh, sunset. So it like mimics the sunset, so it'll slowly get dimmer and dimmer and dimmer over the case of like 10, 15 minutes and switch itself off. You also get one sunrise as well. It gradually gets brighter. What is it? Chocolate. Is it shit chocolate? No, it's getting up. It's mine. Nah, nah, it'll be gone by the morning. Um, meteor shower. It's got um, it's got other ones. I can't remember they were. Effects Lab. Okay, here we go. So it's got like a gaming one, and it's got all these different things in it. I can't remember which one this was. Um, games. Here we go. So it's got a racing game. This is a racing game. So they're obviously yeah. Uh, there's loads of them. You get you get the idea. You get the idea. Uh, I just need to reset that to default now. Um, oh. I uh, I don't think I can't set like through. That's just through the app. Um, I I, I don't know if it's addressable. Um, for other stuff like that, if that makes sense. I mean, it does. I have tied it in so that when stuff does happen, um, so I can get a new subscriber, it'll flash with the light above, if that makes sense. I don't know how I can get it to do that sort of stuff through Lumia Stream. I don't know if it's possible. It's something I'm going to have to look at, but we'll get there. Yes. Bear, stop it. But we'll get there. But uh, I got that for... That was the eBay auction I won. 33 quid. Three, four pound postage from the British Heart Foundation store on eBay. So obviously mine is going to a good cause. Normally I think they're about 50, 60 quid. But if you get the app, they've also got a thing in there you can earn reward points. So you can do X, Y and Z and then you buy it through there. That reward points takes money off. So I could buy another set of them if I wanted. And I can get like 13, 14 quid off. Plus I've got like another five pound gift voucher through them or something. So I can get like 12, no, 17 quid off, 18 quid off. If I want to buy more. Ah, so far so good. And it's bendy as fuck. Like it's proper bendy. Um... Yeah, I mean, it's like, it is actually like that bendy. You can draw shapes and stuff with it, and it's got like patterns in the app that look like fish and trees and guitars and shit, and you can set it up, and when you pick that one, it sort of has the lights for that particular, 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 particular doohickey. Oh, I'm in the wrong fucking one. Who joined us tonight, when? If not, I'll just crack on as is. In single player. God, computer's slowing down. Will do, but might but might be me again. Oh, as in it quits out. Or do you want me to just start a multiplayer one? Anyway. If you join, you join. If you don't, you don't. Ah. Um. Uh, okay. 
I'll quit out. I'll set up in a multiplayer one. If you want to join me, you're free to join me. <laughs> Hello? Hey. We sounded like Alan Rickman there. Hello? <laughs> Alan Rickman. <laughs> that episode in um, Family Guy where he leaves himself a message. And he's telling him about the joke to remember the joke. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, you can get that one. That's a three meter one. You get a five meter one as well. So yeah, it's, it's proper bendy. It's like a lot bendier than I thought it was going to be. But the the sticky things, I don't think, I can't see them lasting. They're like 3M taped. And um, all these ones kind of fucking fell off. But they seem to have stuck all right now. And note to self is do it. Stick the sticky things on the wall first in the predicted pattern. Then stick the fucking light to it. Not the other way around because that's how they fall off. But they do have um, raw plugs. And... Uh, screws so you can actually hard mount them which is pretty cool <laughs> excuse me uh, I've muted this why have I muted this there we go right what did we get up to what were we doing last contamination removal visit the southwest mine which one is that That must be a... Uh... Oh, I don't want to do that one. Hmm. Maybe we do. Maybe we do. So we need secure container times five. Now, do we think these secure containers are going to be one slots? Or... Do we think they're going to be four slots? Right, well... My fucking specific P12. Sorry, Pacific P12s here. So we'll take a jolly along the road. Mm. As soon as it's up that way. We'll get the crown set up. Um. But yeah. I um, may have ordered that airsoft rifle win. Hmm. Fucking stupid bastard. You know, the amount of money I've spent on airsoft kit, I probably could have bought myself a new rig by now. <laughs> hmm. Ah! That's all good. Hey! Well, I'm doing the uh, visit the southwest mine, which is secure the containers. I've got a crane going up there, so I mean, if you want to get a five slot um, trailer and join me up here. Mr. Bear! How's it going, sir? I'm going to run out of fuel before I get up here. How's it going, buddy? Look at the lights that your donation bought me. I've still got a little bit left. So I'm going to save that and put it towards my uh, new rig. I wonder if I can get, like, a custom thing on it. Hmm. Taking a break from the pot. <laughs> oh, no, the Danny man's back. Oh, shit. That sucks, mate. How are you feeling? Yeah, I take one of them. If not, I can... If not, I'll... Uh... Fucking come back and spawn a trailer. Uh, yeah, but I was just going to say if I needed to come back. I might have to go and get my other um, dairy that's down the river from here. Because I think the trailer it's got, it's got fuel in it. If not, I'm going to have to get uh, something else. That's saying you're full of shit, as in you mean. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. That sucks, mate. I mean, I, I can't even begin to imagine 
I mean, I've only ever had like a really bad stomach virus once, which would maybe be sort of like one percent of what you're going through. And I mean, it was constant. It was back and forth the toilet for fucking hours. My mum went fucking mental. This was when I was much younger. Um, turned out I had like a stomach virus or something along those lines. And uh, yeah, so the doctor came out at like two in the fucking morning. Um, he's like, I'll give you an injection. I was like, okay. I was like, uh, can I just take tablets or something? He went, no, 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 this, this injection goes in the old buttocks. I was like, fucking really? And he's like, yeah, you got me out at two in the morning, so they're going to have to suffer. Anyway, fucking best night's sleep I'd ever had. Fucking stopped shitting my ringer almost instantly. Um, so yeah, that was that was it. Uh, it turned out I had a, a fucking stomach virus. And I'm about to run out of fuel and probably the most... Ooh! Oh god, that's a bit delayed, isn't it? Sima, how's it going? Uh, yeah, I called the doc and they're like, did you take your meds? And just said, well, keep at it. Ah. Not really much you can do with that, Chris, is there? Alright, we'll have to stop this bad boy here. I need to... Porcelain Throne, all hail the king. Oh, for God's sake. Nope! <laughs> I'm good, good. Doing good. You? Uh, no bad. I'm surviving. Uh, just plodding on, mate. Um, run out of fucking fuel, as you can see. Uh, oh, God. Thankfully, going to the dentist tomorrow. Ooh. How are you going to manage that, mate? I mean, I don't mean, like, how you're going to manage it. I know how you're going to manage it, but... Um, Alright, just before lockdown. Is this attached? It is attached, but I might be stuck. Is how much fuel's in this thing? Uh, I told them as long as they have a bathroom, I'll be good. Oh, God. Um, I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing here. I've got fuel in here, but I don't know if it's going to make it across the old river. Well, we shall see. You seem to be going all right, mate. You seem to be going all right. Um, no, not yet. Um, I was saying the amount of money that I've spent on airsoft this year, I probably could have bought a new rig. Um, so the money I've got left. I'm after buying these from your last kind donation. I'm going to keep put towards um the new components for the rig. What the fuck am I doing? Playing the game. Oh. How much do these cost? Um they usually I think they're sort of roughly um, about 50, 60 quid. I got them through off, off eBay through the British Heart Foundation um, shop for £33 and £3 postage. Um, they're, these are RGBIC, which I don't know if that means individual individually controlled oh i meant the pc all right okay um i can get motherboard for about 150 ish uh, between 100 150 quid uh my mate at work has a processor uh and some memory that he says he was willing to lend me lend me give me um so that's uh, a ryzen 5 3600 I think so that's free um, and the where am I going can I go that way no oh wait a minute that might be a shortcut that's the way to go actually uh, and memory so that's eight gig of memory and then I think I need to get a new a, a cooler for it because the one I've got won't work so that's anyway I, I can check the coolers out but I'd maybe imagine 50 100 quid um, and what else do I need after that? I don't need the tower because I'm just going to swap the components out. I might have to look at a new power unit. So that's what, 30, 40 quid? 
And, oh shit, we might be stuck. So I think all I really need to succeed is motherboard, power unit. So let's say about 200-ish. SS, I know I'm gonna need a new SSD, so that's maybe about 100 quid. Because the one I've got isn't, um, isn't big enough. But I can, I can, all that stuff I can just tack on and just get as I need. So, you know, I'd probably say about 200-ish, 250 max, and I could get exactly what I needed to get everything set up. If I was to buy one new, you're probably talking four or 500 quid, depending upon where you get it from and what spec you get it for. Um, oh, shit, I've got a puncture. I've got a puncture. Um... But yes, this is it's not really. Hugo Simo, he yeah, has some I, I should. Channel points for you to play with. Oh wait, here they aren't real. Chop the paper, 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 paper. You're a dick, Wayne. So yeah, so paper, I'd probably say a couple of hundred quid would be what I would need to get it done. But if I wanted to just be lazy and buy a rig, I'd probably say anywhere between four. I could probably get something decent for. Four, five, six hundred quid. Three hundred sixty-one dollars. Yeah, I would imagine so. Probably around about that. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, because if he does, I'll fucking send it back. <laughs> I know the last time he was fishing for information. What's your favourite number? Eighty-three, obviously. <laughs> um, yeah, I could easily do that, man. I mean, what I might do is I'll sort of like, might chip away at things, so like one month I'll buy one thing and another month I'll buy another, but I'm one of these people that likes to sort of just fucking, I would rather buy everything at once and then get it all done and out the way and built up than have to wait months to then find out that I've either fucked something up or the bit I've got is knackered or, you know what I mean? But, um... CPU's not compatible with mother yeah, no, I mean, it will be compatible, otherwise it gets added to... Yes, that's it. It gets added to a pile, it sits in a corner, and then it's one of that things that's like, I can't afford to get with something one month, so then it gets knocked off, and then something else happens, and something else happens, and something else happens, and that's exactly what happens in my life. Um, yeah, you bought it, buy it again, ah, shit. Yeah, and you just have to keep fucking... So yeah, so I'd rather... Probably just try and save and do that, and I think, oh, I don't know what the graphics, graphics cards are pretty much compatible across the board with stuff, aren't they, really? I don't know, I'd need to look at that, I mean, the other thing would be potentially a new graphics card, and if that's the case, then that's, that adds significant cost to it as well, but... I think the graphics card I've got will still suffice for now, I mean, at the end of the day, it's... If I can get a new rig for running, for streaming, and to make the stream quality a bit better, the, you know, the output resolution and all that sort of stuff, and just get it to just generally look a bit nicer, then I'd be happy with that. And then I could get another graphics card later on. Uh, I, the, the sole reason of the only graphics, the reason I've got the graphics card I've got is because I needed it to run the capture card. Um, but in saying that, um, then it then opens up the possibility for getting internal capture cards and stuff like that. Well, these are all going to start stacking now, Simo. Do you not get like... Uh, what are you? Oh, fuck. You just appeared. Yeah, I'll get out the way up here and you can go past. I need to... I'm going up the hill. I'm going up to that mine. It's got fuel on it. I was using it to go and recover the uh, one of the trucks originally, but it just went to shit and just didn't work. Oh fuck! No, I, I should use my reference. Yeah, well, not this one. Uh, oh, that works a lot better with the drop suspension. Me, no, I didn't put my beacon on. Alright, just fucking abandoned ship and rolled off.
Yum. Heavens to Betsy. We've got some thick mud. Oh, we can get the winch up there. Push it in, push it in, fucking ram it up gear. I was watching a video on YouTube the other day. I just said, she's a pussy, you can't send it back, it's easy. <laughs> uh, yeah, that would be the thing though, like you, you'd do that and then it would get hit customs and then I'd have to pay import tax and all that shit on it. So it would end up costing me even more money. <laughs> <sighs> Boingy. Yeah, so I was watching a video on YouTube the other day and it was going five different types of drivers in SnowRunner. One was the double stacker, which is kind of like what I did. Um, there was someone else that, like, there was another one that was the send it in high gear everywhere driver, which is, which is Paul. I can't remember what the other one was. There, there was the wincher, which basically um, all he does is just, like, winches everywhere even when they don't need to. Um, what else was there? There was the wind chair. I don't mind, there was someone else like. It was, it was actually quite funny. The wind chair. Oh, there was the one that like basically like takes like more trucks than they'll ever need with them. Uh, just realize you need one follower to reach 300. Yeah, I do. Just make a fake account. No, don't do that. Because then I'll know. Because if like Simo6531 appears. Oh, there's a fucking five slot here. Then I'll know who it is and why it is. <laughs> right, this is going to get abandoned here. I already have two accounts thinking for I think so. So technically, <laughs> technically I'm only fucking, uh, I'm 298 then. What? <laughs> Oh, no, that doesn't count, mate. It doesn't count. I'll not take it. It'll have to be 301. And I'll reset it to 301. <laughs> you know, it's taking me forever to get to 300. Tactical nuke incoming! <laughs> oh. Right. Uh, where the fuck... Are the secure containers? I bet they're not even here, are they? I bet we have to go drive somewhere else now, aren't we? My mic's not on mute. Are you shitting me? Oh, I don't have a crane in the back. Shit. I have. I'll, uh... I'll steal the fuel out of the, um... Pacific. Uh, no. Oh, fuck. I will steal the fuel out of this bad boy. I think they're just one slot, aren't they? Yeah, I'm bringing that back now. Fuck, if I'd known I didn't have to drive all the way there, I'd have just fucking... Ugh. <clears throat> My seed stream seems to be holding up a bit better. The encoding doesn't seem to be... Uh, I don't know, how smooth is it looking? Is it running all right? Oh. Probably should have repaired this before I drove off. You just see the tip. See the just see the, the tip of it. Oh yeah, that was it. There was the other one. It was the color coordinator. Never mind, it didn't work. <laughs> what does yes mean? <laughs> um, oh yeah, probably having to go back. Uh, uh, I'm going to lurk for the rest of the evening as I'm doing something. No worries, Simo. Thank you very much for popping along, sir. Ah, oh, cheers, Chris. <laughs> no, I'm just eating ram and rams.
Yeah, pull me. <laughs> oh, that's alright. I'm going now. Yeah. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and find um. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, this one on a hundred percent is fucking ridiculous. Uh. My chair's dropped. I think. Or something else I need to fucking buy. There. I think the gas system in this has finally given up the ghost. Just goes. <laughs> Either that or the kids have been fucking about with it. Uh, what was I saying before that? Oh, the lights, the brightness. Yeah, it's fucking. It's stupidly bright. I had to uh, dim them down. Um, I, I, I saw that afterwards. Um, yes, that's what I was saying. Uh, I want to get like a see if I can get like a smart light like, spotlight type thing that's up here that I can fucking use for the flashbang. So it's like it's an individual light that'll basically just go poof. You know what I mean? Like right in my face. Nine bang. <laughs> um, so just so it's like fucking stupid to I'm sure my um, my mate Liam was saying that he uh, there's a guy he watches that plays Tarkov and uh, he has something similar or it's one of the sound effects sounds like a flashbang in Tarkov so when it goes off the guy genuinely thinks he's like cunts are throwing flashbangs at him um, blind the neighbours <laughs> just get the spotlights although there is um, they do have uh, like spotlights, scoby spotlights, you get four of them, they're like exterior ones and you can hook them up and they all sort of do the same shit just outside and you can set them to do mad patterns and stuff and I thought that'd be fucking pretty cool if I could was to do the outside of the house and oh there goes the encoder shitting itself again Um, I have to change that again might have to drop my <laughs> every light in the house goes on <laughs> <laughs> the sheep will go nuts. Yeah, set one of that ones that uh, it's like a fucking impossible sort of goal. So like if you raise X amount of, or you make X amount of money in the stream, that like every single light in the house goes on, like it fucking just goes nuts for like five minutes or something. Wife come downstairs, get ready to stab me. The kid's wondering what the fuck's going on. Oh fuck. I would say you could have it so you could have, like, it would activate cameras in the rooms as well, so you'd see it going on, but then, it, you know, that that's just wrong on all sorts of levels. Because, you know, I would forget they were there. Sitting, scratching my arse and doing things married people do. Sleep. <laughs> oh. I was actually thinking about uh, replacing my keyboard and getting the Rocket Magma. Nice little thing, it's only like 40 quid. I was like, no, stop spending money, save it for essential things. That stuff can wait. Are you broken? You want a nudge? That's what she said. Oh, now I'm stuck. Oh, they're all over the place. I'm there. Ah. Oh, yeah, I just see it there. No, no, it's just slow. That fuck crane wouldn't left, it got caught in the fucking exhaust. Ah, oh, poop. That's one way to do it. Yes, so we have no Paul with us this week. He's uh, on his holly bobs. Right. 
No, I'm just trundling. As trundling? In a helicopter? Uh, no, but his, his car's probably, um, probably got more tech in it than Airwolf ever did. <laughs> if you don't know what Airwolf is, Google it. You should know what Airwolf is, Chris. Chris? Chris? <laughs> what up, Chris? <laughs> Uh, yeah, he's uh, yeah, <laughs> he's down in uh, he's down in Wales just now. He's gone back home to Wales. Um, I think his uh, missus's missus's his wife's family's all from down there. I think it may have. Uh, you've missed one. No, you haven't. All right. Uh, his wife's family's down there, so I think they're down there for the week. Shit, do you think this will reach that? Maybe go in. I was going to reverse the trailer. Nah, be like fine. We'll find out. Oh, yeah, I'll go. Watch this, we'll see how heavy this is. I think they've improved the cranes in this slightly. <laughs> Did you see the way that wobbled? Uh oh. Oh shit, I almost fell over there. Where do you just go back to the factory warehouse? I love how I've got this in all wheel drive and the front wheels just do nothing. Uh, it's saying it's there. I'm seeing the extra marker, eh? That's a bendy tree. Oing, 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 oing. <laughs> Woo. FBI, open up. Shot myself. <laughs> <sighs> You see that game that Brew was playing the other day? It's the only way I can describe it is it's like uh, city skylines if you could control individual people and drive around the place. Um, and you set up like your own businesses and stuff like that. But I think you have to... Um, you have to go and uh, like go to the supermarkets, not the supermarkets, like the mini marts and whatever it is. What would you call them? Like Walmart, stuff like that. To go and like buy the stuff for the shops. Okay, you're going forward but your wheels are spinning backwards. Will I park too close? Nah. That makes a really weird noise. 
Can I stick that at the front? Will it go at the front? Yeah. <laughs> See, I'm quite impressed with them lights. They're uh, they're pretty cool. Like, I'm actually wanting to get some more for around the house. Um, you can get there. They also do ones that go around the back of the TV, but they've got like a little camera that sits in the front, so it like reacts. So it kind of the colours behind it and all that mad sort of shit, you know. But they were quite expensive. Uh, should be able to. Oh fuck. I need to uh, find a bit of stable ground is what I need to do. Well, what I'll do is I'm just gonna... I'll reverse this down here because it looks a bit sketchy. Ow. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah, I mean, if you want, uh, uh, we'll see where it goes. Uh, it's just the warehouse. Where's the warehouse? To the factory warehouse. Uh, oh, fuck. The factory warehouse is... It's the, the roundabout. You know the one where you make the... Stuff. The... Consumables. You know the big roundabout that's literally down from the garage? It's there, so it's the other side of the fucking map. So you'd be just as well to carry straight along that road. Yeah, so you just carry straight on. Uh... Oh, fuck. What's going on here? Ah, there we go. The tree will hold you. Uh, maybe. Oh, doink. You know, it's not like it's radioactive or anything like that, Kev. I can get in there. There you go. Oh, will do. Nah, I'll just stick some C4 on it, Chris. That'll fix it. That dog will hunt. What's that? Alright. I've not seen that yet. When's that out? Got it. Oh shit, did you go left on that road? Or did you go right? What's left? Oh. I'll just follow the main road then. No, oh, it's a... Uh... Oh. A river. Nah, tramp on. Horse on, Macduff. We're getting a wiggle on. We are getting a wiggle on. I'm going to take this back to the uh, the garage. Actually, no, I'm just going to recover it. Because if you're doing that, I can uh, crack on with something else. Right, what other missions have we got? Searching for underground fires, forest cleaner. Four burned logs. Uh, those ones, I don't know if they're like the giant ones or something. Find that thing. I know we could pick it up and find out it's just all logs. Yeah, it says four burnt logs, so I don't know. I'm guessing they're big. It just says log loader crane is required. I'm going to have to scout that. Oh, here, what's this? Oh, the dairy. That got fuel in it. 
Sometimes it just means pick up four. Of course it hasn't. Stick them in the trailer. Which creates like burnt logs. Yeah, maybe. Like maybe it's just meaning pick up four or them manually rather than pick up from like a destination or something. Where's the road in? Oh, there isn't one. Oh well, let's make one. Oh, we've not got a lot of fuel, so this is fucking stupid. Yeah, it's not gonna work. We'll do a different mission. Uh, yeah, fuck the fires. Timber for the locals. Preventative care. Deliver to the the road. Bend to the bra what? There is a ranch right near the edge of the burn forest. The owner's really afraid the fire will spark back up, so he's asked us to haul his hay right to our storage. Will you help him? We'll have a look. Ah, okay. Truck with Queen. With Queen? With Crane. <laughs> Required. Uh, there's a dairy there, so I think what I'll do is I'll accept that one. I'll bring the crane through. Yeah, we'll drive the crane through. Drift or truck. Oh, fuel station. Oh, come on. Not backing out. Quite literally. Are you falling over? <laughs> Is it El Brocchio? May got a bit too sideways. <laughs> I'm on the way with the crane. Is there radioactive containers everywhere? I don't know why. <laughs> oh. Maybe if you just stay where you are and I push the trailer back over it might fucking sort of slot back in again it's like that time that it's like that time Paul stole my cargo even bastard no it's just like the tail just fishtails the trailer fishtails and bloody dead go absolutely hammer and tong I'm on my way. I'm getting there. Not very quickly. I've got to turn my uh, speakers down. Fuck. Oh, fuck off. Oh. Cock. Oh, well, at least the trailer will be there. Yeah, the, the truck won't be though. Bastard. Mm. At least it's just round the corner. The garage, it not? Mm. Holy Jesus! What is that? What <laughs> the fuck is that? Yes, indeedy, Christopher. What the fuck is that? Wank is what that is. That's probably what it should do just now. Just fucking blow up. How come I don't get that fucking information? I don't get nothing! I fucking get, I don't get nothing! Nothing! I get nothing! I don't get fucking any information! Crocodile pack. Have you seen his new game? Dead Drop. Mm. It's like, um... I think I've seen it. Uh, it's meant to be like, um... Off the stage, I think. Oh fuck, what's it called? Warzone. But set in a building, you go up the levels. It's pretty cool, like. Looks alright so far. Do you not, did you see that one? Is it the finals? Uh, not yet, no. It's got like the evolution thing from Battlefield. Alright. It's literally like you can just like, if there's a team hiding out at the top, you can just like take 
Blow the building, fuck. <laughs> so, a Pokemon gym. <laughs> a Pokemon gym? Uh, what, where are you going with this? <laughs> oh, fuck. Ah, right, where did we get? Oh. Oh, where's my dairy? Nah, you shitting me. Is it not saved it? Ah. Uh, saved it like pretty up frequent. That's what I thought. Ah, oh, right, right, go, go. Tower of Terror. I don't know. I don't know where the. I, I, uh. Well, this is the first time I've sort of had it lose something that significant. Because it is. I mean, it's not even showing it in the trailer. We'll go and have a look. They might be in the trailer. Oh, they are in the trailer. Why is the trailer way back there? No idea. Not a fucking Scooby. Um. Are you want to take something along that way and pick it up, or do you want me to just do it? It's not too far, is it? No. Do I think what I've got that I can use? Do you want? Do you want to see if you can put a truck out? Yeah. That, that way doesn't mean the truck, my truck disappears. Dumps. What truck do you want? Have a full, full rear, um, something's capable. Oh. Something's capable. As in what you had before, or do you want something else? What have you got? Well, I can, I can buy whatever. The Maze. The six, the RSK or the six thirty one twelve, six three twelve. Power to wait. Ah, you had you've had the the six three one two, wouldn't you? Aye. Six three one two, aye. Modify. Decent on it as well. As in, like the mad engine and stuff. Yeah. Uh, that would actually. That one's worse. Back on. Sand. Uh, what did you have? High range gearbox. Pretty low gear. Lurk! Thank you very much for the lurk, Samurai. Mm. What does he have? Give him raised her. I don't know what tires he would have had on it, so I'm just gonna put my tires on it. Yeah, hey, it could be worse, Chris. Sorry, I didn't see that comment. I don't know why. Um, yeah, this doesn't happen very often. I mean, it's kind of the fucking multiplayer side of things. Is like this is the worst I've sort of seen it in. Uh, this is for Wayne, so I just put the stupidest winch on him. Um. Yeah, the worst I've sort of seen it, like, or stuff like that, you know, it's, it's not fucking, never really used to have any sort of issues with it, um, in the old games, you know, or not as much, if that makes sense. And you can choose the colour. Ooh, don't tease me like that. Penguin. Why was the penguin popular? Uh, no idea. Because he was an ice guy. <laughs> cheesy, but I mean. It ain't easy being cheesy. Was. Right, there you go. Uh. Penguins exist in America? Like the biscuit. Did you get penguin biscuits, Christopher? I'm just, uh, oh, there's a wee scout there. Oh, dear lord. What was that all about? <sighs> and... I... 
Need the Pacific. If I recover that, and I'll leave that there just in case it goes to shit. What have I got? Probably not based on Google. <laughs> Uh, that can versions, Tim Tams or, some, or something similar. Tim Tams, wigwams. Um, Mexican versions of things. <laughs> uh, what's a Mexican bird? A rock hopper. That's not Mexican. Uh, what the fuck am I doing? Are you, are you stupid? I said what? penguin biscuits, not penguins. Fuck's sake. No, that, that's what he'll mean. He'll mean he'll have a lot of Mexican versions of things, so it won't be like a penguin. It might be like a penguino or something oh, like that. I thought you meant like penguin birds or something. <laughs> what is, what is a Mexican oh, I'm, I'm doing that one. I'm going to do that one. Infrastructure. Uh, deliver to the railway station. Rails. Mexican bird. What Where do we get the rails from... I don't have to craft these, do I? Animals. Uh, apparently, penguin thing is an Oz. <laughs> uh, what am I doing? Global map. Where's the you rails? Have, like, Twinkies, but I suppose you're getting them, getting them like dots. Right, so we need that trailer. Right, so I need to go to. Ah, where are the rails? Uh oh. Oh, fucking hell. Where? Oh. There they are. Ah, fucking typical. Finish your wham juice. Ah, uh, yeah, it's fucking, it wasn't great, like. Oh, I still got fucking fuel in it. How's that got fuel in it? Ah, oh, I ain't got a fucking crane, though, have I? Ah! Oh. Fucking sucks balls. <laughs> oh dear. Right, uh, where's my Pacific? It's here. I can't really do much with that until uh, you come and get it. So in the meantime, I'm going to go and make myself a fuel truck. Uh, which I can use to top shit up. Yeah. Well enough. Is that, uh, the retail parking thing you did? I went to Hobart. He's like, yeah. Cost always shot on Monday. In Aviemore. Yeah. No, that's a new one. Be closed and blacked out. Unless it was just maybe just it's the time of the year, I think. I think all the staff that are in there actually come down from uh, come down from Inverness. To be honest with you, just because it's like there's no lights on. Usually, it's like even at that time, there's people. Yeah, there's people I get a fuel tank on this. Just because the only lights that were on was the light for the snug. Yeah, no, I think sometimes that uh, the the struggle with staff. Uh, um, I just don't think they can get the staff around here. Sorry? Want open more shops? As well, yeah. Nobody wants to work, though, that's the thing. Or nobody wants to work in hospitality anymore. Uh, perhaps closest would be Hello Panda Cream Filled Cookies. Uh, which you could make an argument Oreos have a version of that. <laughs> Are they in mud tires? This is what annoys me about this game. Oh, you got disconnected. Oh, that sucks. Again. Did you get disconnected? Oh, from Discord. Right, okay. Actually. Well. 
I'm going to try two birds, one stone here. Can we get a fuel tanker with a fucking crane on the front? No, don't be daft, Kevin. That would have been handy. You might get that with, I think. Because I have eight wheels rather than six. Yeah, maybe. You might have space for like a crane and then a tanker in the back. But then it's kind of defeats the purpose. What's the point of having a crane if you've got a tanker in the back? Yeah, this is true. I like the trailer there. So. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get it. Oh my god, can't get under it. Why is that? It's the angle. Oh fuck. Um do you want me to uh you might be able to use the either that or use the Pacific to try and nudge it. Oh, this thing is flying. Back in, no, no, that was a big pigeon. I must warn you, I am absolutely fucking thundering along this road. Oh shit. Good night. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Is that saying less haste, more speed? Is that even right? Well, point in case. <laughs> Slow the fuck down. Ah, fuck. Ah, oh, what? That sucks. Uh, plus, it probably has five times as much sugar in the US. No runner. Trying to. I fell over. Uh Ah fuck a duck. I uh I have right royally fucking wrecked this like. Had it for like two minutes. It wasn't even that, mate. Oh, that tree's useless. Winch isn't powerful enough to, uh... Pull me over. Just out of the garage? Uh, yeah, not far. Not far from the garage. Oh, dear. Ah, there's a scout right next to me. Yeah, because this is going to work. This is very David and Goliath-esque. This is never going to work. If it does, I will be fucking incredibly surprised. That's what she said. That's not good. Wait a minute, I wonder if I can... <laughs> oh, why am I even bothering? Why am I even bothering? What are you trying to do? Uh, pull myself back over. Ah, oh, I went the wrong fucking way anyway. What a fucking twonk. Uh, right. What have I got? Yeah, it'd probably be easier to be honest with you. 
knocking down. Right, let's try again. Let's try not fuck up this time. Oh, fuck it out. She's got a fair wobble on there. Oh, wobble dong! Hey, uh, you got any plans this week, Chris? Or you just uh, the dentist and try not to implode? Bouncy! Yeah, I'm on late shift this week, which is a bit of a shitter. Oh. It's not actually too bad, though. It means I can get a long line in the mornings. My encoder does seem to have settled down and behaved itself a bit more. Um, I think what I might do is drop to 30 frames a second instead of 60. Let's see what that does. Yeah. Just makes it look a bit. Oh fuck! Am I going the right way? Yes. Jesus. Already. Dentist Tuesday. Chemo class Thursday. That's it for this week. We are fucker. That sucks, man. How long does the? Uh, how long are you at chemo for? Is that like a sort of couple hours a day or is that like a whole day thing? Or they just kind of do what they do and send you home? Now I can offload these bit. Nope. Uh, yeah, you just have to take it to the thingy. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. Oh shit, slow down. Where's the uh, Pacific? Did I recover that? No, I should still I should still be here. They're uh, gonna hitch me up to a new chemo pump because the chemo pill experience had been so full of shit. Ah. That's crap. So they just like... When they're injecting the stuff, do they... Uh, is it just like a sort of drip in your arm or something? Infusion is equals three hours every three weeks. Oh god. They just stick like a drip in your arm or something and it kind of goes around that way. Sorry for all the questions. You don't have to answer them if you don't want to, mate. I just never sort of understood how any of this shit works. Uh, that's kidney dialysis, isn't it? Essentially filters your blood. There's a drip into your arm. Oh, okay. Oh man. And you gotta sit there for three hours with that in. Fuck. Nintendo Switch. Buy a Nintendo Switch. Yeah, well, except I have a chemo port surgically installed that they hook mine up to. What? That sounds, uh... I'm gonna have to Google that, mate. That does not sound fucking pleasant at all. Or device used to draw blood and give treatments, including intravenous fluids, blood transfusion, or drugs such as chemotherapy and antibiotics. The port is placed under the skin, usually on the right side of the chest. Oh, okay, so... Is that, like, under the skin, and then they just stick, like, a fucking... a needle into it, and... Oh my god, that looks fucking horrible, man. Oh. Going cyberpunk on it. 
I have one. Use them. Focus on making sure my meds aren't trying to destroy me. Fucking hell, man. That sounds fucking horrible. Ah, oh, man. All for the greater good, though, eh? That's fucking... I feel sorry for you, man. I really do. That's fucking... I wouldn't wish that on anybody. Well, there's a few individuals in this world, but... I'm not... I'm not getting into them. Eh, uh, four slot. Ah, oh, fuck. There should be a... Trailer. It's back, basically, where we were before. At the fucking mine. Oh, what the fuck am I stuck on? Wow, that's like the first time I've been, like, properly fucking stuck. Uh, first infusion, we figured out I'm severely allergic to med. To a med. Second infusion, I couldn't talk above a whisper because the neuropathy caused my vocal cords to not work basically for two hours. Fuck. Uh, they had to get nurse assistance to the toilet, which wasn't too fun. Oh, fucking hell, man. That is fucking grim. Wow, this bit's dead fucking muddy. Closest field to being disabled. Fuck. That's not good, mate. That's not good at all. Hey. There. Uh, but I continue to shit on. <laughs> uh, just got a roll with shit. Sorry, mate. Oh, now we're both stuck. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah, I did that. It just pulled me fucking all the way back, though. Duck funny. Yeah, uh, Doc was finally like, uh, you're switching you to this pump, which does the same thing as the pill, but only lasts 40 hours, compared to two weeks. Could be good, could be bad. Ow. That's fucking mental, man. I think there's like a fucking tree. I don't mind the questions, you're the only friend to ask them, honestly. Uh, everyone here just going about their daily life. Ah, shit, man. Yeah, I mean, it, I can't imagine it's been... I can't imagine it being fucking easy to fucking talk about it, you know what I mean? It's, I mean, I'm finding it sort of... awkward. Kind of asking, you know? But I'm glad that you, you you give me an honest answer with that, you know what I mean? If you didn't want to talk about it, you could just tell me to shut the fuck up. Um... No, it, it, it interests me to know how sort of all this stuff sort of works and that I think I'm actually genuinely fucking, like, stuck stuck. Like, there's something here that's stopping me. Uh, oh. Tactical nuke incoming! Blazing mad, how's it going, sir? I can shut myself there. Um, yeah, it's just, uh... Yeah. It's, it's a... It's a bit of an awkward conversation, I think, isn't it, really? You know, it's... Are, are folk fed up talking about it? Um, not fed up talking about it, but they don't want to ask you about it in case it's sort of like, you know, you're fed up sort of um, having to explain to people what it's about and go through and have to relive it and shit like that, you know? Um, 33. Scary part is the colorectal cancer stuff is showing up in younger and younger ages than normal. I'm 33. The dentist kids. Holy shit. That's mad. So is that like a... Is it mainly a genetic thing or is it fucking... You know, is there something else that's causing this? 
I mean, it's cancer, I suppose, isn't it? It's fucking... It's everywhere, really, isn't it? It just depends what you eat from what I know. Oh, right, okay. So is that, like, sort of, like, processed foods and shit? Is that sort of stuff that does it, or is it, like, too much fizzy juice, or too much alcohol, or... Just... Just the way fucking food is in general just now. Gotta get that colonoscopy at age 50 normally. Fucking hell. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's fucking mental to think that when you're going about stuff that there's saying stuff like that, there's essentially fucking, well, they are kids, really. <laughs> Catching it. Nah, man, that fucking sucks. Are you already back there? Oh, no, you've got to pick it up from the, uh, the mine. It gets delivered to the railway station. Oh, have you already picked them up? <laughs> uh, that's what I thought, I thought... Uh, you get it from up at the mine. You know, the one that we were at before and then it told us to go and drive somewhere else. I got lucky, I found it at stage three at my age. So what... Is stage three the early onset then, is it? Or is that quite advanced? Is like stage one the worst then? Or stage one... I wouldn't say the best. Oh, stage four is the last stage. Ah, okay. Fuck. Stage one is the best, right, okay. Because I seen something the other day that, that uh, Sam Neill, the guy from Jurassic Park, he, he's got stage three blood cancer. I think my dog's farted. That stinks. So how did you, um, if you don't mind me asking, how did you find out you had that? Was it just a, just a doctor, a routine check, or was there, you know, you had... Oh, that didn't sound very healthy. Was there something like stomach, the stomach upsets or stuff like that? Uh, stage three is right before it spreads the other part, oh, for fuck's sake. So you've kind of caught it just in time then. Because, I mean, it's scary to know that you, you could potentially have this and not know it, not find it for months, years, and then by the time you do realise that something's wrong, it's like, well, had we caught this six months ago, you know? Fuck. Yeah, one of the lads I used to to work with, um, he thought he had uh, stomach ulcers, and that's what he was treated for, stomach ulcers, for months, maybe even fucking years. And then um, they went in and did whatever it was. And they're like, ah, yeah, you've uh, you've got stomach cancer. Or whatever it was. So he was like, ah, oh, fuck. So anyway, that was how he signed off from work and all this. And they were going to get him in for the operation to remove it and blah, 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 blah. I, unfortunately, he went in for surgery. And um, they basically just sealed him back up again. He woke up and we're like, hey, we're really sorry, mate. You maybe got three months to live. And, uh, that was it. So he fucking lived that three months, like... Well, obviously they were his last three months, so he fucking lived them as best he could. And then, uh, what I'd heard was that he wasn't feeling too great one day, so he said to the missus he was just going to go upstairs for a lie down, and... She went up a few hours later, and sadly he was no longer with us. Um, so yeah, it just goes to fucking show you, it's fucking... It's horrible, man. Doc thought I had a hemorrhoid, blood and poop. He sent me to another doc who told me I needed a colonoscopy. He just in case. Usually, if caught at stage one, they can cut it out during the colonoscopy. Okay, so I take it that I'd imagine it's stage one. Then it's obviously not very big. It's fucking still horrible, man. 
fucking horrible. To be honest with you, I don't know. Like, I mean, I, 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 I'd like to, I don't like. It's not the right word to say. I don't know if that was something that would be over here, if it would be something that would be picked up on as quick, if that makes sense. Oh, you just strained your shit out. You just, just strained your shit out too much. That's what it is, you know. You've been wiping your arsehole too hard. Stuff like that. But I think there's sort of, there's a lot more sort of campaigns and stuff on like TV now and stuff about that sort of thing that's sort of like, oh. I thought you were driving the truck behind me. <laughs> that sort of go on about these things and get folk to get them checked themselves and all that and stuff, you know. Oh, fuck. Well, no, I haven't. I'm gonna fall off the cliff if I don't get fucking away from it. Oh! Uh, okay. They did a week of radiation to reduce the size. That made the pain go away. Now I have six rounds of chemo infusions left, I think, then surgery. Oof. So uh, the surgery will be there to remove what's left of it then. Fucking hell, man. So if you're saying six rounds of chemo and that's one every three weeks, it's another like 18 weeks, is that right? Ouch. Yeah, well. Yeah, well. Well, if it doesn't, there's a step deck there that we can use. Uh, not a step deck. Uh... I'm sure it'll fit. We'll find out. We'll see. We'll see, right? If it doesn't, we can use the... We can use the... Uh, use that one or the other one. It'll fit. Bit of fucking spit. Anything goes. Um, but they might change it because of this... Because of the week... Of this week of switching... Ah, got you. Maybe you're right. Maybe it is a bit wide. I think you're right. Oh, a little bit higher, Kev. A little bit higher. Roll over and dump. Nope, I wonder if it'll pack on the other one. Can you reach it? Yeah. Nah, I have to move it, obviously. Let me change truck. Sick. Oh, you stopped the engine. It, uh, yeah. Is it silly, Kev? Me. It's a bit jerky. Dunk, dunk, junk, jank, 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 jank. Ah, oh my god! What? This just fucking crashed on me again. I'm still in the game. I'm not. Uh... This is every fucking time. I wonder if I've got a mod on that's causing it to crash. Practical nuke incoming! I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find out. Fuck's sake. I'm going to have to try and, th try and thin out some of the mods that I'm not using and switch them off. You have no idea how bassy that is in my headphones, eh? Just a at the end. What's my favourite one? I don't know if I've, uh...
Uh, Noot Noot's obviously a good one. Knock Knock, just because that's fucking like... FBI, open up! <laughs> oh, God, anyone walking past my house must be like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Party Mark 2, here we go. Oh, sounded like it started there. I'm going to thin out some of my mods quickly. Is there anything that you use? Boron. Paul hasn't used that in a while, has he? Disable that one. That Voron staying on, uh, uh, as of, even. His old man, he played one, he played knick-knack on my drum with a knick-knack paddy whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home, this old man. He played two, he played knick-knack on my shoe with a knick-knack paddy whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home, this <laughs> old man. He played three, he played knick knack on my knee with a knick knack paddy whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. <laughs> uh, right, we've deactivated a couple of the mods there. We'll see if that makes any fucking sense. Uh, we'll see how far back this has actually fucked us up. Um. It's just getting to the fucking point now where it's kind of like, it's almost as if it's like... It's unplayable to the point. Other than deactivating mods completely. I did hear like people complaining about uh, how the multiplayer needed fixed. But I never experienced it so I thought folk was just talking shit. You know, because we never really had any issues with multiplayer in this really all those time ago let's see where my maze is oh no we're all back there we're all still there that's fine okay so it's <laughs> it's literally in the trailer from uh, before. So it didn't actually go too badly. You might have had something on then that I've switched off. But all I've had's the Were you using the the A rack or anything like that? The Delta A rack. The Mercedes looking truck. Uh I switched that off. Fuck's sake. I haven't got any mods on that you wouldn't be able to. I'll reset it. Oh, fuck knows, man. If not, I can come back out of it and. Well, I don't think this is going to fit. That's definitely a four slot, that, isn't it? I'll give it a shot. We'll give it a shot. I would think he sh should fit that. <laughs> oh, actually, it might fit. It does fit, we're laughing. That'll fit. That's a three slot, definitely. 
No, I think it's three. Oh, no, it's three, I. Yeah. Is it still saying the mod thing? Saying the host has five mods in the map. Well, I don't know why. Impossible to pack. Oh, fuck me. Well, to be honest with you, I think it's going to stay where it is. Yeah, that ain't moving. I'm gonna shore it up. Uh, unless it's maybe something can't nah, it'd probably just be unless it's this fucking mod. Unless oh, I don't know because maybe I've accidentally switched the mod on. Maybe it hasn't downloaded it for you yet. I wonder if it's because it wasn't on straight. Oh, where are you going? Nope. Oh well. We'll uh, see if we can uh, just see how we get on, eh? Huh? Although I might go and use that Maze instead. Fuck's sake, what am I doing? I have absolutely no idea what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Turn around would be a good start. Because at least with that one, if it fucking falls off, I've got a crane to at least try and manipulate it. Well, this doesn't want to turn. Ah, I'm going to fill this up with fuel. Mazzy, I'm going to fill these both up with fuel, actually. At least that way there will be full. Full of fuel. And then we're going to attempt to take this railway tracks where we need it to go. Oh shit. The handbrake on that helps, Kevin. Ah! Can we get right round here? Yes, yes we can. Um, there was tight squares. Sparks. You know, the way I've parked this, I'm gonna have to fucking shunt it to, uh, get around the corner. Piss. It seems to be pretty fucking solid. 
so far. Nope. Fuel tank. Dragoon? Just gonna leave all these up here. Um Right, let's see how far we can get before this goes to shit. Mm. This is a funny feeling this is just gonna fucking fall off, isn't it? I uh, will see. I mean, the saving grace might be the fact that it's got that fuel tank bulkhead. So it might sort of stay on it a bit better. Either that or this particular trailer is just for vehicle transport, if that makes sense. It does say it's got three slots on it, so maybe it is. Maybe it is. Um, just for vehicle transportation, this thing, because it's got one of that uh, tilt decks. Let's try to slam the brakes on, see if it moves forward, but. It's not. Well, so far. Yeah. What, your game? Yeah, I went to the mod thing and it said mods are downloaded. I was like, what? Uh, maybe it's one of that things. I took mods off, but I don't know, maybe it's... Maybe I've accidentally switched one on. Or maybe because I've deactivated them, it's updated them, or I don't know. Works in such weird ways. Hey, fuck it, minute. I don't want to go that way. I want to go straight on. We can actually get something achieved. Achieved? Completed tonight. Although we have got one done. Hey. Eh? We're going the wrong fucking way. No. For fuck's sake. What's this say? Why did it say it failed? I think I might have to, um look into it a bit more, maybe just start playing it without any mods. I mean, we don't, I don't use a lot of mods, you know, there's only one or two that's actually sort of, I mean, I, I might have a few of them on, but I don't actually use many of them. I mean, this trailer is one of them. I mean, that's not really game breaking, you know what I mean? That's kind of just adding a bit more variety for the transportation side of things, you know? And the Mazai, this thing's not exactly Okay, well, the engine that's in this might be a little bit more powerful than I'm, I like to play with. But, um... I don't like to play with fucking stupid mods. I don't like to play with ridiculous OP mods. I remember seeing a post somewhere. The guy's like, Oh, can anyone suggest any mods? I don't like... Uh, it's, the game's too easy with all these mods. And then, and then, and then, and they're like, Well, just, just don't use OP mods. You know what I mean? Play the game as it's meant to be played. I mean, if I was struggling to get missions done, or if I was wanting to just get stuff done for the sake of getting stuff done, I would have a different save. And I would use all the stupid mods on it, you know what I mean? Like a cheat save. You know, if I was achievement hunting or something like that, or just wanted just to get fucking stuff done a bit quicker and just get fed up with fucking getting stuck and getting damaged and all that piss, you know? I would do that, but I, I generally, I'm not interested in that. I quite enjoy this game for what it is. I just basically just need to follow this road right the way around. Um, I think that's why I kind of like enjoy it. It's because it's... 
you know, I mean, if you fucking make a stupid mistake, ah, oh, you go along a track or a road too fast, or you fucking, you, you know, you take the corner too sharp and bounce off the rock face, that's your fault. You know what I mean? That's it's kind of like you only end up fucking this up because of your own actions. Whereas you know, if you're playing something like Call of Duty and stuff like that, yeah, fair enough. You can, you know, if you're not quick enough, you get fucking shot and die. But there's also other variables out there, like you get people that could be fucking like wall hacking or people that are just genuinely just fucking amazing at the game and just one tap you. You know what I mean? You don't even know you're around the corner and all they need is a fucking bow here around the corner and you're dead. You know what I mean? I like this because it's a bit more you're in control but you're not if that makes sense you've got more um, control over what's going on what's happening and I think that's why I quite enjoy playing snow running I've always have done I mean it, you know it's one of the first games I sort of properly played when I first started streaming and properly enjoyed it I still enjoy it now. I mean, that's a good couple of years now. And I mean, I know it's not everyone's cup of tea and not everyone likes it and fucking, it's like, oh, it's just fucking boring, you're driving around. Just, but I, I'm past the point of fucking, like, running around like a fucking mad twat trying to get kills and just getting all sweaty and Call of Duty and stuff. I mean, like, I talk about Call of Duty, I mean, like, Modern Warfare 2. Like, the original Modern Warfare 2 in Black Ops, none of this remastered gubbins. You know, I, I just can't be bothered with that. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like... I like the fact that in Battlefield 2042, you've got the the offline modes, you know, the AI modes and stuff like that. But even still, that fucking rattles me something chronic sometimes. You know, try to take objectives and your AI is just like... Instead of just respawning because no one's coming to heal them, you've got about 15 million fucking soldiers downed on a field and you just can't do anything. And, you know, you capture one point, and as soon as you've captured that, the other one starts going. Then by the time you get over to that one, it's too fucking late, that one's gone, you recapture it, the other one's already gone, you know what I mean? It's just pissed like that. I had one that was like that the other night, and it just kept yo-yoing between Alpha and Bravo, and I was like, oh my god! I was just like, fuck it, I'm just gonna kill farm. So I just sat there, just shooting people. Trying to get fucking attachments on a weapon, and then before I knew it, it's like, oh, they've, they've taken the other objective. Right, where do we go with this one? See, I wish if there was, like, missions and stuff that you would do stuff here that would, like, tidy the whole place up, if that makes sense. So, like, if I installed these rails, it'd be nice to know if it, like, will install the rest of the, not install, but fix the rest of the stuff, you know? Like, tidy that warehouse and stuff. I mean, it might. I don't know. Oh. Fuck. Oh, man. No, because it's not packed, it won't deliver it. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I'm just gonna go and get a different fucking trailer. I wonder if I've actually got anything kicking around nearby. What's that, your carrier? Ah, uh, what's that? That's a fuel carrier. Fucking twat. Um, I wonder if I've got anything through the other map I can bring through. What's this? Sideboard. Sideboard. Ah, oh, there's a fucking gooseneck there, but I've no fucking fuel in that truck. Uh, sideboard. And to be honest with you, it would be... Oh, wait a minute, what have we got at the log station? There, bloody, uh, people try to claim that no, Putin. Uh huh. His body doubles were out in Bastopol and Mariupol. Ah, oh, right. Because of the fucking. The chin. <laughs> He's got a lot of fat under his chin. And, like, previous picture when he was doing the meetings, like, his tin chin's, like, tight. <laughs> it's like. And, like, the cheekbone and the, the structure of the face looks totally different. Uh. 
from a side on perspective. Right. Where is that in relation to that? I would and be also state the fact that during the video thing he didn't speak much, if anything. He just nodded his head and went. Ah uh, right. Reminds me of the Hitman movie. Where the guy takes the body double of the Oh yeah 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 yeah. Aye, right, he's not end up topping the other one. Right, I think we're um because he shoots him in the head, and then day after he's in the hospital, it's fine. Yeah. Like, oh, that was his body double or something like that. Yeah. Oh, was it the plant? Oh, was that? A three slot. Flat bed transporter. <gasps> What's this one? That was a good. It's an alright. That was a decent game to movie sort of thing. Yeah, I don't think it was too bad, like. Is, do you reckon this is a two slot or is this a three slot? That looks like a three slot, doesn't it? Yeah, it's definitely a three slot. Yeah. Right, let's see if this can. Uh, Ah, it's in. Ah, right, okay. Remember if you had if you had the crane in the back, the bed in the back, because it pushes the bed back. Ah, oh, bastard didn't get round. Ah, yeah. And there is no game that we like it. Put the trailer on because that was the crane. No bother, I will look into the uh the what do you call it? The fucking mods and see if that maybe has a bit of an impact on it. Bit of a fucking pain in the arse, like. I'm going to go back to get fuel first before I go that way. No, cheers for that. Well, at least I know the lights work. Sort of. I'm half expecting to wake up in the morning and them to be, like, on the floor. It's the sticky things that have broken on them. What's the... oh, it's gonna hurt. Whoa! The fuck was that? Three. Fucking hell. I didn't take any damage, but it sent me about fucking 30 feet back. Fucking weird. Good old snow runner logic, eh? You know, to be honest with you, I probably would just be better getting another fucking truck coming the other way and refueling. Well, I've started, so I'll finish. Fuck What's me that? in the face with an hard bark. Oh, it might be a bit, might be a bit fucking slow. Right, I'm going to try and get this mission done before I go tonight. I don't have to get up for work until at least fucking half seven, so... Oh, I don't want that. My uh, supplies are full. Cool. Code works. Doesn't fucking surprise me. Someone's probably fucking kicked up fuck about it and they've cancelled it because some politician will be involved in it now. To be honest with you, I don't understand how they haven't fucking finished it already. See if they just pulled their fucking finger out and got it done. Like, I've never known Roadworks to take that length of time. Shut the road for the night. Shut the road. Well, the day. 
To be honest with you, I mean, the amount of time it's taken them, they should they should have had it finished by now. They should have had it finished months ago. No, because like I remember a couple of weeks back, I drove past there and it said as of the, it was I'm sure it was like thirteenth or something. They said that the road would be shut for seven nights between the hours of seven and six or nine and six or something like that in the morning. But the longer. But the longer they push it back, the busier it gets. I mean, that's them now into fucking the Easter holidays. You know what I mean? So it's now fucking an even busier time of fucking year. I mean, I get that they might not have been able to do it with the cold and stuff like that, but if they just fucking finished it in July, August last year like they were supposed to, you know what I mean? I, I honestly don't understand what it is they're doing or why it's taking so long. You know? It's probably just a fucking bunch of cowboys like uh. well, I guarantee when it's done, it's gonna break up. Well I mean look at the fucking state of the fucking road every time. There's like a fucking trench on one side of it. Well, and then all they did All they fucking did yeah, all they fucking did after that, I'll just put a bit of fucking sand in it. Follow this road. So literally, it's the 26th, which is next Sunday. So Can't remember. They pushed it back a week. Mm. I don't get it, but it's that's the first week of the fucking Easter holidays. You know what I mean? It's just fucking stupid. And then it'll get pushed back, and then it'll get pushed back, and then it'll get pushed back. See, I reckon. I reckon when shit like that happens, if it's, like, if it's genuinely something wrong, i.e. like the weather that prevents them from doing it, fine. But when it gets to a point where the road's been in that fucking state and there's been traffic lights there on and off for the last fucking six, eight months, then they should be held accountable for that. They should be charged for that. They should be fined for it. They should have money taken off what it is that they've quoted for the contract, you know? As simple as that, and that would encourage companies to fucking pull the finger out and actually get it done in the time, you know, and then if they get it done in set time, you know, they could essentially earn themselves a nice little bonus or something, you know what I mean? Where the fuck am I going? But I just think it's just, it's just, honestly, it's fucking ridiculous the amount of time it's taken them to fix a junction. They should have just left it as it was. Or even worse, or even just, just put fucking traffic lights in. You know what I mean? Three sets of traffic lights, two on the roads, in and out. I, well, yeah, you wouldn't even have to put a roundabout in. Traffic lights. Yeah. Just fucking set of traffic lights. You know, one going out the village, one coming out the village, one off the Faber Drive, set them back. And so fucking just just as it yeah just as it is and fucking job done. That would have taken a few weeks, if that, to set up. Ugh. But then if people like start complaining like, oh, what does this and it does that, well, all you have to do is have it on like a fucking 30 second, a minute cycle. So you're sat at that junction for two minutes tops as it goes through, you know what I mean? So southbound, folk just drive in straight through, turn left, whatever. Folk coming through the village, straight out the village, turn right. You know, it'll be all this fucking, you'll sit there and you'll turn in right and you'll be sitting for fucking 20 minutes waiting on the traffic lights to change. Or there'll just be, there'll, uh, God, there'll probably be more accidents there than there is anything else, to be honest with you. Yeah. I, to be honest with you, I just think it's fucking stupid. I don't think it's needed. 
no one's going to listen to it. I mean, I agree with it. I agree with it. But fucking... It's... It's just fucking... No one listens to it. Nobody listens to it. The fucking... The way that people come screaming through here most of the day. I mean, fucking Mackenzie said he was pedalling back... Not pedalling back. Scootering back from school there the other day. Somebody went past him on the main road doing 50 mile an hour in a 30. And the only reason he knew it was 50 mile an hour is because one of those speed signs flashed up saying it was 50 mile an hour. And I was like, that is fucking disgusting. Like, that is just downright fucking ignorant. How much of a fucking pig do you have to be to drive through a 30 mile an hour speed limit section when children are walking home from school and you're doing fucking 50? What kind of fucking person are you? I mean, seriously, have a fucking word with yourself. Honestly. It's just fucking... Some spike strips. Aye. It just fucking... It just annoys me. You know what I mean? There's absolutely no need for it. Absolutely no need for it. Like, because fucking... God forbid it, if he'd fucking fallen off that scooter and landed in front of him, he's dead, you know what I mean? All because some cunt wants to go a little bit fucking faster. And to be honest with you, that, I, that should be a ban, because it's one and a half times the legal speed limit. Simple as that. It's just, it's just fucking disgusting. Absolutely fucking disgusting. Yeah, I do. You know, all I do is I just, I just fucking hog the white line. I'm an absolute dick. See if someone comes fucking screaming up behind me like that. Like, I understand maybe if I'm doing, if I was doing like fucking 50 mile an hour in a 60 and someone's screaming up behind me and pushing to get past, yes, that's my problem. I would maybe, I would move out of the way because I'm that kind of person. I would pull over and let them pass. But if I'm doing fucking 20 mile an hour and a 20 mile an hour fucking scheme, and some fucking knob jockey comes honking up behind me like he owns the road, then proceeds to sit on the white line to try and intimidate me, I'm not going to move. If anything, I'm going to go fucking two miles an hour fucking slower, and I'm going to fucking hug the white line. I had a boy do it to me one morning. I was driving through fucking Abbey, where I was like, fuck you, mate. And he kept going, and I just kept moving over. Just kept moving over and over until I was literally sat on the white line. This boy was then a quarter of the way on the opposite side of the road trying to peek round me. And I'm like, what are you doing? Like, what are you attempting to achieve here? You know what I mean? I love doing that to folk. Fucking love it. Yeah, exactly. Or the dickheads that fucking, you know, you're coming along the road and they pull out in front of you only to turn at the next junction when there's absolutely nothing behind you. And I mean the space of like five, six seconds they could have waited and you'd have been clear. Oh, God. I fucking hate other road users, man. It, it, it just... It just fucking annoys me. I mean, if you're late for something, tough shit, that's your fucking problem, not mine. Left, you should have left earlier. Should have gotten up earlier, mate. You know, you want to drive like a dick. That, that's on you. But don't fucking... Yeah, better to be late than not arrive at all. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know. This is just old Kev coming out now. I just, I just honestly just don't get it. I mean, I get that people like to drive fast and all this, that, next, but fucking do it somewhere where you're not going to fucking wipe out someone's kids or fucking take out a family because you come round a corner and it's a little bit wet and the back end steps out and you wipe out half the school kids walking home one day, you know what I mean? Fucking have a word with yourself. And then you get people complaining that like, oh, well, if they put a 20 mile an hour in there, it's going to be this and it's going to be that and then, 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 But it's always the people that complain about it that don't fucking live here. You know, they're the ones that don't have to deal with it because their house is fucking up a dirt track somewhere. You know, they're nowhere near the fucking main road. Yeah, well. 
Uh, it's not going to stop folk doing that. I think they're planning bringing in this, like, rolling out at 20 mile an hour in every Scottish village. Alright. speed cameras or you need to install speed reducing measures i.e. like fucking speed bumps or the you know the give way in stupid places so like on stupid blind corners so folk can't go rattling around them so they have to fucking stop and wait to see if there's a car coming the other way you know it's like that stupid fucking section at side of the, uh, you know the bottom uh, co-op you know that road along there they put that in there to fucking they put that in there to try and stop people to basically wind their fucking necks in, but they all still fucking drive like fucking dickheads. Oh, those boxes move. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Oh, no, that's this bad, Kev. Shit. Uh, uh, uh. God, this is this is definitely not working, is it? Probably should have taken a bigger crane. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, you know what? To be honest with you, I mean, it, it didn't really need to be there anyway, you know what I mean? I think they just stuck it in there to slow the people down. Kind of help, you know, mm, fucking hell. Aye. I don't actually know what I'm attempting to do here. Fuck it, that'll do. <laughs> Why is that not, uh... Be put on the back of that. Uh, no. My, uh... Hopefully, railway tracks. I don't think this is going to lift it though. Uh oh. That's three slot. Uh oh. It's whether I can get the fucking thing. Uh oh. No, 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 no. It's whether I can. Uh... Fucking hell. That actually lifted that. Oh, bet. See if this is a fucking. See if this is like another fucking one. See if this doesn't work. It might not snap to it because it's sideways. Oh. Change that as well. It better fucking work. Otherwise, I'm just gonna lose my shit and just call it a night. You know, offload it into the. Print offload it into the bay. No, it's gotta be packed, though. Uh, I don't know. I'll maybe try it after this if it doesn't work. This might be another one that's... This might be another one that's fucking like...
Oh, thank fuck for that. Yep. Oh, I just need to... It's the front I need to get into it, isn't it? Oh, my ramp's still down. Oh, shit. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. Boom. Infrastructure restored. Whoosh. And we're back on track. Now we can resume supply. You did great. Good. Whoa. Oh. Kinda got a bit wonky. Right, uh, can I get rid of that trailer? No. I tell you what, we'll just uh I think I might call it a night of that. I'm starting to get a bit fucking stressed. Stop truck. Stop engine. Come back on. Change truck. Uh Store. I think we'll not use that trailer. Actually, you know what? It's fine. Just stop there. Ah, railway station warehouse. Ah, okay. We have metal beams. We have cement. We have small pipes. Metal rolls. Service spare parts. Concrete blocks and bricks. So it looks like we've got quite a bit of uh, stuff now. That is bright after a while. Fucking hell, it's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a while. You know what? Fuck it. We'll maybe try one more. Cargo container. Where do we pick up that wig? <laughs> Where do we pick up the cargo containers? There's two there. There's there's two slots, aren't they? And where are they supposed to go to the trailer park? Where is the trailer? The trailer park's down there. That might be a nice cushy wee mission. Especially, especially, was there? Uh, no, I could use the truck I've got. Uh, should be a four slot. So. Yeah, but if I was to use this, the dairy with a flatbed, that would be sufficient. Ah, uh, fuck it, that'll do. I'll do it. I'll do this one, then I'll fuck off. I'm actually gonna cheat. I'm gonna put in the fucking... Uh... Mm. Way markers. Just to fucking try and speed things up a bit. I think there's fuel in that... Trailer. Refuel. Yes, I can get the Dragoon, that's fine. Change truck, dairy special. Yeah, I don't need woken up at this time of night, Chris. It's bedtime. Officially. Am I too far away now to fucking refuel? No, I'm not. I'm tired too. Yeah, but you've got an excuse, mate. So we'll let you off. I don't. I'm just lazy and tired. God, this thing's a fucking hippo. You have kids and a job. I was off today. That's my excuse for me. <laughs> like one of the kids, he was at his mate's house most of the night. I don't think he came back till about fucking half seven. And then uh, the wife's been out all day. She was at work and then she came back. Uh, I'm just gonna fucking ah pipes. Oh god, that absolutely destroyed me. Actually, I was gonna say I just drive straight across the fucking railway yard. It's not gonna work though. And puppies. <laughs> yeah, well. Yeah, bear's just a bit of a fucking knob end. He's King Billy. I 
Right, we're gonna get this mission done. And we're gonna call it a night. And then we'll see what percentage we're at. I'm hoping we're kind of... You know, it's slow progress. I think we're doing like sort of 4 or 5 percent a fucking night. You know, that's like fucking 2-3 hours a pop. So if we're at 50 odd percent, then... God, there's got a few days left in this leg. <laughs> Wonder if there's like anyone's actually attempted to like speed run snow runner. Like how? Could you, I don't even know if you. No, you couldn't, could you? There's bound to be some way to do it, but someone will like glitch it and bug it, and there'll be something stupid like you do this at the exact same moment in time, and it duplicates the cargo or. You, you leave something somewhere and you can do something and it helps fast travel or some shit, you know? There's bound to be something stupid. It's like when Paul used to do the old fucking hell. Paul used to do the old duplication glitch. Oh, I've just knackered my fucking suspension. Do I have any way to repair it? No, 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 fuck. Oh well. We've got broken suspension. Let's uh, change the suspension mode and just jack it up a bit. Give us a little bit more fucking... We're also down a wheel. Maybe we won't get this mission done tonight. But if not, at least if I can get this where it needs to be, I can bring a recovery truck to uh, help fix it. Shand. Oh god. Usually best to call it quits when I'm tired. <laughs> I know what you mean, Chris. I'll get to it later. Yeah, I know I'm the same. I'm the same. I use I probably should just fucking call it a night, but We'll see what happens. If I can get there, it's not far to go once I've picked it up. To uh, to complete the mission. Uh, cheers for that, Wayne. Take it easy. No, I'm just fucking miles away. Um, I used to use the I'll finish this field, then log off method. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't always work like that in farming sim, though, is it? You're like, oh, look at this, and then there's like a sale on, and then you get like loads of stuff, and you're like, oh, there's a great demand for grain. If I can get all this stuff done in the next hour, I can make like $15,000 million. Usually end up three hours later, exactly. Surface of Mars there, very red sky. Red sky at night, shepherd's delight. Red sky at morning, shepherd's warning. So glad this has got the race suspension. It's actually sort of like making it a bit easier to traverse. Yep, I have got burst tires and blown suspension. But the, uh, the suspension was the red suspension seems to be, uh, assisting, you know, so it's not like it doesn't look like it's slammed. We'll get there. We will fucking get there. In fairness, I probably you'd have, should have used the old tilt deck Dragoon trailer and used the, uh, the repair kit that was in that to fucking repair some of the damage that might have mitigated it slightly. It may have replaced the spare wheel, I don't know. To be honest with you, we're not actually that far from where we need to be. I think it's just going to be the issue is lifting the cargo container and trying to squeeze it on at the one at the back, so... It might have to be one of that ones where I ditch the trailer. Uh, and then... Load it up that way. See, this might be where we start to struggle with the fucked suspension and stuff. Ah, fuck it, send it. Fucking rattle it! Did 
Yeah. Good day. Hope they'll get a bit of a better night's sleep tonight. I was pissed last night. Fucking ended up waking up. At like back in four in the morning. And that was me really till six, half six, and then the kids they woke up and decided to do kiddie things. Wander through Ask the time, ask if they can watch YouTube at like quarter past six, half six in the morning. It's like, no, go back to fucking bed. I don't know how I'm going to be able to reach this, uh, this second cargo container to the rear of here. It's just not gonna work. So yeah, I think I am gonna have to ditch the trailer somewhere. Where are we? Uh, there might be a nice flat section up here somewhere. Let's see if we can get through this puddle. At least this, if I can get somewhere that I've got a bit of space, I can. Pick one up, load it, uh, and then transfer it. Or I could try double stack. That would probably work. I think if I can squeeze that in there, that'll do. We'll detach it there. And see if we can, uh, uh oh, pick this up from here. Oh, fuck. You just know how this is going to end, don't you? This is just fucking asking for death, isn't it? I bet the outriggers aren't even going to fucking work here, are they? Oh, God, here we go. Well, that surprisingly went a bit better than I thought it would. Uh oh. That's it. Nope, oh, wrong one. Hmm. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Oh god. This is just asking for fucking trouble. What's wrong with that wheel? There we go. <laughs> um. Attaches all the way from there. Oh, she's struggling. She's struggling, but she's going to get there. Easily exceed the maximum safe loadage. You know something? Maybe we should just fucking double stack this. It's not going to work, is it? Nah, it won't work. But we're going to just try and drive this up here uh, and see if we plop it on at this other trailer. <laughs> yeah, you don't play this for realism at times, do you? Look, if it works, it works. That's all I'm saying.
That's a new thing. I've never noticed that before with the... Uh, when the crane's moving, the siren, it's got like a little warning beeper. That's new. Or have they always had that? Heartbreaking. Fucking hands are sweaty as fuck after that. Oh, that fucking front tire's flat, isn't it? Oh my god, this bridge looks like it just could fucking fall apart. Oh, fucking hell, that's a fucking. That is that trailer like got additional wheels on it, or is it? Uh, trailer controls. Ah, oh, that does have an additional axle. Let's get that dropped. Uh. I think we should get this mission done hopefully in the next 15 20 minutes. It's bedtime! I got work tomorrow. I get a holiday. I had to day off today. Today went like fuck. It went really quickly. Like ridiculously quick. I feel like I accomplished nothing. Which is how most of my days usually go. Let's see if we can get up this big fucking hill. God, very windy tonight. Woof. Come on, you can do it. Yay, on the main road. Right, I just need to quickly check to see where we're going. And then we should be a hunky dory. So it's basically just fucking follow the road right round. Um, actually... This has got repair -y stuff. So... I think... We'll, uh... Should be able to fix this. Exaggerate cab supplies. Uh, we want the dairy, so we need the suspension more than anything. Uh, oh, wait a minute, we've got fucking more spare wheels. Oh, we got spare wheel. Yes, I'll do that. I knew that was handy having that thing kicking about somewhere. We'll drop the suspension mode just so we don't fucking fly about the place. Right, this shouldn't take too long to fucking do. Providing we don't have any mishaps.
And if we do, then I guess I'll just have to rage quit. Simple as that. High gear doesn't go much faster, does it? I think we'll uh, we'll stop at the petrol station on the way past. We'll get some disease all. Nice big shiny axe. Not that you can see it. Sixty mile an hour, sixty kilometers an hour. Hmm. I'll be lucky if I'm doing twenty, if I'm honest. A nice log line in the middle of the road. Need to slow down because there's a fucking stupid tree about here somewhere. Oh no, it's actually moved. Oh fuck. That trailer took a bit of a unfavorable bounce there. What's the matter with you? You tired? Dog's getting fed up as well. I don't blame him. I don't blame him. Right, let's get this done. Then we'll see how much we've completed. What did I say we were? 41%. 43%. Oh, no. Right, fuel. Next stop through the wee village. Uh, into the trailer park past our garage and we should be home and dry slowly just chipping away you know I'm not even gonna fucking slow down going across the speed bumps I don't think the speed bumps gonna do any damage no boop, 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 boop. Don't like look at those gates. Gates? Ramps. Oh, Jesus, Bear, you're fucking humming. Fucking hell. I've never known a dog to fart the way mine does. Fucking chewing on it, man. Oh, fucking hell, that's making me ill. And we're here. Boom. Boom. You're the best. Thanks from all of us. That's it. That's fucking it. Oh, I think we're about to wipe this poor boy's caravan out. I'd hoped I could have just squared that up a bit better. Obviously not. Right, I'm just going to drive this back to the garage. Uh, I'm going to actually get rid of this trailer, to be honest with you. Oh, turn. Fucking hell. 
She wasn't keen there, like. It's the unit that needs to be in there. Trailer store. What have I got? There we go. That'll do. That'll do. I think we'll just recover a garage. Boom. Job done. That mirror looks a bit fucked. Uh, leave garage quickly. What are we up to? 45%. So we're fucking 4% complete. Fucking hell. Is it 4% complete? What did I say we were at? 41. <laughs> right. Obtained one truck. Two missions completed. Two missions completed? No. Oh, yeah, because it went to shit, didn't it? So that was, what, three missions then? change what a pain in the ass anyway thank you very much to everyone that popped by this evening greatly appreciated as always christopher i hope you get on all right with your chemo tomorrow or was it thursday you got a dentist tomorrow haven't you that's it uh samurai thank you very much for popping by and giving us a hand uh i'll see you all again hopefully on friday at the usual time, I won't be here next Friday because I'm actually away to Glasgow to see the Midnight in Concert at the Varalands. So I'll not be there Friday, so I'll probably try and maybe squeak one in on the Thursday evening, maybe Wednesday, just to try and sort of... I don't want to be up too late on the Friday, on the Thursday night if I'm driving to Glasgow on Friday afternoon. Anyway, uh, goodbye. Thank you very much to everyone that popped by. Greatly appreciate it, as always. I will see you again on Friday at half past eight. So until then, folks, cheerio, take care. Tara.